Yo, yo, what is going on, everybody? It is D Man coming back at it again with another YouTube video. And today we've got gameplay on Steve Hutchinson. So he is the newly, the newest addition to the team. We're gonna go ahead and check out the lineup real quick. Brief little, uh, you know, look at the lineup here. As you see, I've got him powered up all the way. His card art finally, uh, you know, fixed itself. Like I, I believe on the theme team uh, video yesterday. His card art, there was some glitch in it, you know, the card art for all the Ultimate Legend, you know, the, all the Ultimate Legend card art was kind of glitched, so it wouldn't let me equip any of them, but I'm just going to rock with this one, you know, the uh, the max, ult you know, the full Ultimate Legend uh, card art on him, so it looks pretty good, guys. I wish he did get, you know, Titan's card art, but it is what it is. I'm actually going to throw some abilities on him. We're going to try him with Nasty Streak. Okay, so 2 AP there for Nasty Streak, and I'm going to go ahead and put a uh, post up on him as well. Uh, and yeah, so I'm gonna have those two on him. I'm gonna have to take off. Uh, I think I'm gonna take off Rod Apprentice on Randy Moss. But let's check out his stats here. Steve Hutchinson, 99 overall. Uh, I did switch up the chemistries. As you guys can see, Steve Hutchinson has zone run on him. So what I do, I have zone run at 31 out of 50, and I have uh, go deep uh, 30 out of 50. So I went away from play fake just for the overall reasoning because I feel like. You know, Randy Moss gets up to 99. Andre Johnson gets up to 97. Um, we did lose a couple overalls. I think Johnny's down to 94. Uh, but I think Bruce Matthews up to 90. Uh, and then uh, we'll, we'll back out and show you the full lineup. But here's Steve Hutchinson with zone run at 30 out of 50. 99 strength, 97 awareness, 99 run block, 99 run block finesse. Uh, that's what boosts up there. And acceleration 84, speed 74. Really, really nice speed on your guard position there. Um, we went over him yesterday, but here's just another brief look at him. I did, you know, the zone run does go ahead and boost up the impact block and end lead block. And so I do go ahead and get impact and lead block both up to 99. So that's pretty nice too. Um, we'll have to see how that works. And I have him with ability. So this dude should be an absolute tank on the field. Um, and yeah, let's back out. I want to show you guys the what the chemistry change did to us um i was just messing around with the chemistry so nate davis was a 92 he's a 93 now bruce matthews was an 89 he's now a 98 right tackle johnny smith went down in overall uh but moss went up in overall too from 98 to 99 cooks at 92 he's the same Tannehill went down from a 98 to 97 henry is now a 90 or he's been a 99 but barry was actually a 98 now he's a 99 andre johnson i believe was a 96 or maybe he was a 97 uh, and then AJ Brown was 96. I feel like the go deep will help help us in the future because um, we'll just have to see. Once we get more upgrades, I'll look to change up you know chemistries more uh, you know more often. But as of right now, what we're rocking with is zone run 31 out of 35, go deep 30 out of 35, uh, and I'll show you guys everyone that has go deep. So basically, all the backup linemen, Janu, Anthony Ferkser, receivers, quarterbacks, I have that on them. And then zone run have starting linemen, Jared Cook, Kerry Blossom game, Derrick Henry, Barry Sanders. So that's everyone that has that. Uh, and then Sprinter, same thing. All receiver, skill position pretty much. Brawler, uh, all, all you know, linemen and Jared Cook there. Uh, and then let's go ahead and check out the defense here. I have locked down 54 out of 50. The other five is on uh, Coach Vrabel. I forgot to take them off, but you guys can see no one has run stuff. But... I actually was messing around with chemistry, trying to see what I could do, but nothing really helped in overall. As you guys can see, I put Avery out here just because I like to drop my out, you know, left outside linebacker in zone coverage, and, and Avery has a little bit better zone coverage than Clowney does. But once Clowney gets an upgrade, I will definitely plug him right back in here. Maybe I'll just move him to right outside linebacker, but who knows? He might be a little higher overall, you know, at left outside linebacker. So, and then also I have Kevin Byard over here with the mid zone KO. Move him to strong safety. He get he gets the second air position strong safety. Went over all this yesterday on the theme team episode. But yeah, defense is looking really nice. There's the special teams. Um, and yeah, pretty much it. Uh, one other thing I wanted to say. What was it? Oh, it's the birthday man today. So Steve McNair. He would have turned 48 today. So rest in peace to him. Um, you know it's pretty sad. You know what happened to him, but we're gonna plug him in for the gameplay today. It's his birthday, so um, and I almost forgot to shout some of you guys out, so we'll go ahead and do that right here. Um, if you want to be have, have a chance, I'm actually gonna do what Xerxes does. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, say, um, and he actually doesn't get cammed up at all, so 
Oh, it's because I still have uh, uh, play fake on him. So we'll change that chemistry out right here while we're doing the uh, shout outs right quick. Uh, right quick. Uh, so if you want to uh, have a chance to be shouted out here, go ahead, comment down below. What should, what should we comment down below? Just just say just say rest in just say R.I.P. McNair, R.I.P. McNair, something something about rest in peace, McNair. Uh, and I'll go ahead and uh, you'll have a chance to be shouted out next video. But I want to go ahead and shout out a couple of you from yesterday that actually hung in to the very end. Because uh, I told y'all to comment something down below for a chance to get shouted out at the very end of the video. Jacob Blackburn, I want to shout you out. Thank you, my guy. Honeydew underscore one. You, you're an OG, bro. You are always in the Noted Gang, man. You, you are always here. Uh, so I appreciate you and Morgan McCabe. Maccabee, I'm not sure how you say that, but Morgan McCabe there. Uh, thank you for hanging around that last video. So, thank you guys there. And we'll go ahead and uh, put McNair's final uh, thing on here. We have Go Deep on him. Uh, we actually might have to change out because, or maybe not. I think Ryan Tannehill had times three as well. So, yes, he did. So, Steve McNair with Go Deep gets up to 95. There's him with Go Deep. So, once he gets his ultimate legend, guys, he is going to be an absolute monster. I cannot wait for that. Uh, and hope, hopefully, he gets a 98 powered up to 99 because that would be kind of upsetting uh, that he, you know, if he goes ahead and gets like a, um, you know, if he if he gets a 97 only powered up to 98, he would be missing out on a couple of, you know, he would lose one ability slot because if you get to 99, you get five ability slots versus 98, you get four. So five ability slots would be absolutely glitchy. Uh, and he'd get Hot Route Master. I wouldn't use that, but what I'd use, I would use Escape Artist, Dashing Deadeye, Gunslinger. Those are the main three I'd use, then mix in a couple others. So, man, that, that his Ultimate Legend is going to be an absolute monster. Uh, but, yeah, with that being said, let's see how Steve Hutchinson is. I'm going to go ahead and activate his abilities here, and let's go ahead and hop into it. All right, guys, hopping into this one. Oh, my goodness. Well, it looks like this will be a free win unless this dude glitches out wins for himself. So that wouldn't be pretty cool. But I don't know. We'll see here. Hopefully this guy's a real dude so we can actually get get a gameplay here on Hutchinson here. Uh, but let, let's just see. Let's see how the uh, first offensive drive goes. All right, guys. So obviously this guy didn't have the best team here. So we're going to see if we can absolutely gash him here. So you guys see up front we have Kevin Mawai. And Steve Hutchinson X Factor, so they both, or not X Factor, but they have abilities on them. So we got Post Up and Nasty Streak on Kevin Y. We have Post Up and Nasty Streak on Steve Hutchinson. Let's watch this block up front here. As oh my goodness, this guy knows what he's doing. He forces Derek Henry to a loss of two. We did start off the game with a pick, so maybe he doesn't know what he's doing on offense. But that wow, that was pretty nice there on defense. Uh, so. I might need to ID someone there, but we're going to bring in Andre Johnson in motion. we got to look to go ahead and get into that second level of linebackers, see if we can do something here. There we go, Steve. I don't know why I said Steve, but Derrick Henry breaks a tackle, breaks another one to the 39, uh, but Kevin Wye got a nice little block there on that linebacker. Let's go ahead and try a run again with Derrick Henry. First couple, you know, first play kind of scared me there. Loss of two, but we're, we're right back out of here. Let's see if we can get another one with Derrick Henry. Another nice run here. Let's see. We got our blocks up front. Great blocks there. Good pull. Nate Davis as he trips us up there for a gain of one or so. Actually gain of three, so that's not as bad as I thought it was. But that could have gone for a lot more. I kind of want to see if we can get a little glitch here with Derrick Henry. Going to just keep running this football. Going to go ahead, run right behind Steve and Kevin Mawai. As there was a hole there, couldn't have, wasn't able to hit it. But gain of four, we will take it. We'll go ahead, come out shotgun, third and three. I'm going to run it again, guys. We're going to see... I really just want to see Steve, Steve Hutchinson um, get, get, get some nice blocks up there. So I want to I'll just watch him here. He's pulling, and we're able to juke out that linebacker, but getting nothing. So it's fourth down, fourth and four. All right, guys, we're going to get a little ballsy here. We're going to try and fake this with Jared Cook on the edge. Breaks the tackle, and we got it. We got lucky there. We're going to fall down, get our first down. Let's get Derrick Henry back out here running behind Steve Hutchinson and Kevin Mawai. Against anyone else, that's definitely going to be a tackle there. We lose the ball on downs, but again, against this guy, see if we can get... Okay, good blocks up front, and I just can't hit a hole. We have a touchdown there if I can just run right through the hole. Second and six, though. And looks like he's lagging. He might just lag out here. Let's see. And he is. So he's going to be on... He's going to take the L here. We'll go ahead and hop in the next one. 
All right, guys, hopping into this one, and there we go. A little bit better team here that we're facing in this one. There's our top three, Sam Mills. Good to see Randy back in that top three and Desmond King. All right, guys, here we go. Marches down the field all the way, but it's a third down and goal. Let's see what he does here. Looking for some stick routes. Nothing's there. He's going to get sacked. Big play. If we are able to hold this dude to three points, this is a big W for the defense. Let's see what he's going to do here on fourth and goal at the 10-yard line. Is he going to go ahead and take his three, or is he going to try and go for it here? And that's it. He's going to try and go for it. So he got it all the way to the one. It was first and goal at the one. And now it's fourth and 10. Let's see if we can go ahead and take everything away underneath. And that's going to be picked off by... That's where Sean Evans can we get a block. Okay, that I should have just taken a knee. But let's see what the offense can do. What a big time stand by the defense. It was first and goal at the one. And we were able to stuff him two times in a row. Then force him to pass. Then we got a sack. And then we just picked him off. What a big W for the defense right there. All right, guys, we're going to start off with a little trap play here to Derrick Henry. See what Steve Hutchinson can, can do. Pretty solid block there, but Derrick Henry unable to break the tackle. If he can break that tackle, it might get loose there, but that's going to be the last play of the first quarter. Next play here. Might look to go some read option with McNair. Who knows at this point, but we're going to go ahead and go inside zone handoff here to Derrick Henry. He's able to fall forward for two yards. Nothing, nothing working so far. All right, I'm going to go ahead and try some mesh concept look a mesh concept look here. We're going to go ahead and put Randy on a slant. Derrick Henry will just block you. Looking for Andre, Janu, or Randy. We're going to go ahead and have Andre Johnson on the sideline. Why are you going backwards? We literally turned a five-yard gain into a one-yard gain. What is that? I try to juke up the field, and we're going to go for it. Same exact play. We're looking for either... That's tough because I took off Rod Apprentice on Moss too. So no one, none of my wide receivers is probably so stupid, but we're going to try it anyway. It, he was in man there too. We had plenty of time. We just, I don't know what that even was. And once again, I'm going to go ahead and lob it. Secure catch and we can't even get the completion. I probably had someone wide open. First and goal once again at the 10. Unbelievable. All right, guys, another big third and goal here. Can we get a stop? going to be a pass play looking for a couple slants he's got a guy in the back of the end zone wide open I don't think he tried to throw it to him we forced the incompletion pressure got to Josh Allen and he's going to be smart here and take his three don't blame him at all because his defense have you know they, I feel like we, we we can do stuff on offense just you know what I'm saying is his defense from what he saw uh the last drive he thinks his defense can go ahead and get stopped. So he's going to take his points there and hope that his defense can get a stop here. Shane Leckler is going to go ahead and kick this one off. He's going to pooch kick it to Jared Cook. I love Cook at this spot because he break. I swear he breaks the first tackle every time. But we get it out to the 29. All right, guys. We're going to go. Uh, we're going to try. We're going to slide left because he looks like he's trying to bring some pressure on that left side. So that's exactly what we're going to do here. Looking for Moss. Janu. We got a step there. Can we get it there? And he's going to... A diving pick by Isaiah Simmons. Touch him down. Unbelievable. Got hit as we thrown. And we saw the pressure coming. I tried to slide left, but I guess I should have brought Derrick Henry in to go ahead and get pick up that. You know, I, yeah, I definitely should have brought in Derrick Henry. But, man, we're playing like absolute trash right now. All right, after a couple of incompletions, it's third and ten. Looking to go ahead and take everything away here. Try to get my adjustments off. And it's going to be a screen pass. And Rashawn Evans... Lays out Bo Jackson. That's what I like to see. Is he going to take his three? He is. Defense is doing their job, man. Defense is definitely doing their job. We just got to stop turning the ball over. We gave him the ball at the, what, 10-yard line there. Uh, and then we just gave it right back to him after the pick. So 6 nothing. We've got to get something going here on on, on, on offense. I, th I still think we're fine on offense. I just have to bring in some more protection. Got to bring in Derek Henry. Go ahead and block him. Pick that pressure up on that left side. And if we slide left, we have plenty of time in the pocket to go ahead and make a play. Because you guys saw, uh, as Joe, see Jared Cook, I swear, he breaks every tackle. Breaks every single one of them. We're going to go ahead and run the same exact play here. I, I, you know, I think Andre's going to get open uh, a thousand times out of a thousand here. All I have to do is bring in Derek Henry. Go ahead and block him. Slide left. And we're A-OK. -okay. I'm going to go ahead and put John New on a streak, too. Put AJ on a streak as well. Pull that safety over maybe 
John who gets open if he's in zone. He's in, been in man most of the time, so see if we can step in the pocket with McNair, make a play. Steve McNair gets out of the pocket. It's what he does best. McNair down the sideline. McNair gets out of bounds at the 42. A rush for McNair, 23 yards. That's what I'm talking about. Well, let's go back to the smash play. I like the mesh because we have a couple of, you know, we got a, two drags and a slant route. We'll have to put Moss on a slant. See if we can get Moss open, Johnu open. See who comes open here as we're going to have Andre. As I don't know why he comes. I don't know. I guess, do I lead it where he has to come back and get the ball? Because that literally can turn into like a 15, 20 yard gain if we wanted to. But I don't know what's going on there. All right, we're looking to go to the flats here. Either Barry or. Derek Henry, whichever one's open. Uh, neither one of them are open, but the middle of the field is wide open. He's using that, but we're going to throw it anyway. Steve McNair throws an absolute dart right over the middle. It's three for five, 29 yards and a pick, but that pick, honestly, you know, was on me because I had to pick up the pressure. I didn't. Uh, so we're going to try a little run play up the gut here. Let's see if we can get our blocks up front. Good blocks. Derek Henry break that tackle. That's Isaiah Simmons. He's got to break that tackle there at the 10. Still got seven yards, or not seven yards, but got three yards, and it's going to be can we bring in Derrick Henry to block? We can't, but we can put him on a drag. I'm looking for... We'll put Johnny on a drag, too. So, two drags. I'm looking for either one of them. Um, neither one of them gets open. McNair is unable to get outside the pocket this time. He gets sacked, so... It's going to be third and 15. All right, guys. Looking for a little flood concept. Looking for Derrick Henry. Looking for Moss. Looking for John o. Uh Really looking for really anyone. I think I had... I think I had Moss on the corner... He sends the pressure, and we get sacked. So I'm going to go ahead and let this take down. We'll take our three, make it a three-point game at halftime. All right, guys, here we go. Greg Joseph, see if we can just put this through the uprights, do his job for us, and he does just that, puts it straight through, makes it a three-point ball game headed into halftime. So we do get ball back at half, so that is big. If we put some points up on the board, we'll definitely take it. All right, going to start this drive off here with a little handoff to Derrick Henry. Can we get our blocks up front? Good blocks there. Derrick Henry to the outside, and he gets hit stick. Gosh, we got to break that tackle. I, 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 you know, that's a safety there. Derrick Henry, I tried to stiff arm. Honestly, should have just trucked him because that was a head-on collision. So we definitely should have just lowered our head and tried to truck instead of stiff arm. I'm going to go ahead and go stretch to the outside. Oh, my God, that was so bad. I'm not sure who that was that got the tackle there, um, but... Good play on his part. We're going to look to go screen here to Derrick Henry. Uh, and get a block up there at water. At water with a big hit on Derrick Henry. So, gains three. Third and 16 now. So, got to have a play here. So, he's been in he, he's been in man. Uh, so, cover two mans. what he's been in most of the time. So, looking for AJ over there. Maybe AJ gets open. Can we possession catch that? Beautiful. Great catch there by AJ. I'm going to go to huddle. Make him get out of this man. Going to make him get out of this man. Let's see what he does. Does he go to change up anything? If not, then should have ran, uh, AJ once again. And we do. We're going to catch and run this one. AJ Brown stays in bounds to the three. All the way to the three-yard line. Going to go no huddle once again. We're going to try and run this up the gut with Barry Sanders. Can we get our blocks up front? Steve Hutchinson, Kevin Mawai. Can we do just that as we almost can go no huddle again to the one-yard line? Barry Sanders, he's probably going to be looking for the run here. We're going to go stick. Uh, and we're going to look for Moss or Janu. Janu, low ball, Janu. Oh, that was scary. So third and goal here. I'm going to go under center. We're going to run this thing straight up. Actually, let's go a little read option. Let's get a little fancy here. Steve McNair, if he if he's standing up there, I'm definitely going to hand this off to Derrick Henry. But can McNair get to the outside? Can McNair get to the outside? And he can. That's going to be a touchdown. Steve McNair, happy birthday. He's going to be, gosh, that, that's just so tough, man. Yeah, Steve McNair, great job, man. Touchdown, Titans. Man, miss seeing that. Miss seeing that. I just love going back and watching his highlights, man. He was something special. But Greg Joseph on to kick it on through for the extra point. We're going up four. That's what I'm talking about. All right, guys, here we go. He's going to go no huddle on fourth and two. Big stop here. I'm going to go hard flats. Can we take everything away? Slants. Going to go ahead and send that guy. And we get the pick with Sam Mills. What a lurk. Can we take it to the house? Can we take the house? Sam Mills wiggling through. Oh, my goodness. No. Bo Jackson gets us down. We're down at the two. But what a play by Sam Mills saving this game. And he's going to stay in here. So we're going to try and punch this thing in with Derek Henry. We might like to go read option again. Who knows? But 
Gonna try and just straight up punch this thing in with Derrick Henry as he just comes straight up the middle with Isaiah. I'm gonna go read option again. All right, guys, let's see Ken McNair work his magic. He did before. He's gonna stand up this time. He's gonna hand it off to Derrick Henry. Can't get much there to the four. We're gonna have to throw this ball. All right, guys, maybe we hit Derrick. Hopefully, he just gets one on one with a corner on the outside. That's what we're going to do. He actually is getting one-on-one, -on -one and I, I just have to take my chance there and try to break that tackle, but good stop by him. Man, gosh, that's tough. God, that's really tough. I guess I should have just ran the ball three straight times with Derek, um, but it is what it is. Greg Joseph's going to go ahead and knock this one on through. Makes it a seven-point game. Still in reach. If he scores a touchdown here, can tie it up. So we got. I feel confident in our defense right now. We've been playing great so far. All right, guys, so it is third and seven. He's marched all the way down to the 35-yard line. There's 35 seconds left. Got to throw a spy out here to Josh Allen because that's really has been what is hurting us this whole game. So looking for the corner route, leaving that open, and we get the sack. Who is that? Is that Albert Hainsworth? It is Albert Hainsworth. He's going to spike it on fourth and 16, and he just lost the game. Oh, my goodness. I don't know if he was thinking. I don't know what he was thinking. But he just spiked it on fourth down. You never see that happen, and that's going to do it. Let's check out Steve Hutchinson for one last time. All right, guys, what a game that was. I mean, I'm not sure if he just – I don't know what he was thinking there. He had a timeout too, so I don't know why he didn't call a timeout there, try and draw something up there on fourth down, but I don't, I don't know what happened there. But here is Steve Hutchinson one last time, 99 overall. Obviously, the post up in Nasty Streak didn't you know I, I like having post up and nasty streak on kevin mawai because normally the center is who you know go to get set into the uh, you know the the second line of defense there with the linebackers he normally doubles over to the uh uh whoever the d tackle is and then he, he moves up to the uh you know the linebackers so with your with your guard normally your guards don't you know go into the second line of defense there into your linebackers so i wouldn't go ahead and put any abilities on on them you know if you do have them uh but um, so Nasty Streak really doesn't work and I already have post up on Kevin Mawai so I'm definitely going to go ahead and take both of those abilities off but for the gameplay for the gameplay sake I went ahead and threw them both on just to see what he, what he looked like but definitely going to take them off put them back on Randy Moss um, and yeah really yeah to be honest don't use any abilities on this guy but he's a really 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 solid left guard 99 strength you guys saw him earlier in the video I'm not going to read over all the uh you know the stats here but if you run play fake or you know he's gonna the play fake boosts his pass block up his pass block finesse up i believe uh so that's also good so i do have zone run on him so i boosted the run block and i boosted the run block finesse up both to 99 so still really really solid lineman here if you guys need one steve hutchison is a really really solid look uh and if you guys were wondering how i got my coins back up at the top right i think i had like 500 600 thousand when I recorded yesterday's video, you guys see the trophies. The trophies are all gone. I spent them all on Wheel of Coin Packs. I had about 700 something trophies, spent them all on Wheel of Coin Packs, and I ended up getting around 700,000 coins, 600, 700,000 coins. That's ridiculous. I think that might be the new, instead of you buying the Red Zone Pack, getting the Quick Sell, do the Wheel of Coins, because I, I think I had one a span of where I, I, I opened up four Wheel of Coin Packs, and I got three 50,000 coin Quick Sells. Like, that's insane. But, that's besides the point. Steve Hutchinson, great looking card. Definitely helps us out on the theme team. Hopefully Bruce Matthews gets an upgrade on the O-line. Hopefully we see a Roger Saffold upgrade here soon. Maybe he gets a flashback card for the Rams, uh, but I'd rather him get like a little bit of a higher overall. That way he gets up to more of like a you know, 99 overall. Um, but still maybe a Lawan upgrade too would be nice. Uh, there at left tackle, that would help us out too. Uh, and then a Jack Conklin power up will be super, super nice once we get him, you know, because he gets that Titans Kim and once he gets that power up. So that would be awesome too. So with that being said, guys, that is going to do it for the video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. And until next time, I'll see y'all.